Blues, they know they have to win today and go in search of bonus points to for sale. Already billing the Toulouse game as the biggest in the northwest of England for four years since their domestic home semi final to the Wasps. But they've got to win here first. Getting his hands on that one and then leaping towards the line to score and celebrate the first try. The Sharks bite first as they seek to set up a dual die tussle with Toulouse next week. Well, that's a poor scrum there from the Blues. But just as we're building up the big Fijian, he lives up to his billing. And again, this squirts out, a little bit slippery, a disappointing scrum. Keep it on! Keep it on! It's a better hit from the Blues, but it was breaking up again, that front row. Here's Casey Laulala. Tom Shanklin is fit, he's on the bench. Oh, he's had this recent knee problem. Picked that one up against the Ospreys. Roll away, says referee Pratt. And the hard work there from the Blues. First at the scrum, and then just to get across the game line. Here's Blair. And that normally means three points. And it does again. The Blues take the lead. They've had one or two problems in the scrum, but not with the rolling more, the Cardiff Blues pack. And now it is on the line to Casey Lalala. To Lee Harpenny. Oh, there's a gap there, and Harpenny is one of the best around and seizing those moments. He just puts his head down. He finds the gap. It's fallen to Reese, who also puts his head down and gets the first try. But the second half, Sayer so don't like it. I'm inside. I want it. And it is going to be checked. Perfect start then for the Cardiff Blues to this second half. Well, that's what Sale's European Cup dreams are doing now. Clinging on no more. Wilson Jones. Cardiff get another try here. And Felice might be the one to supply it. He's given it inside to Davis. They've got the try. And they can start to think not just of the victory, but of a bonus point as well. Here comes Gaskell, running a superb line. Oh, what a pass! On to Matthew Tate, and we've got some game now, haven't we? Tate for the sale, Sharks. Hits back straight away. What a lovely pass from Gaskell that was. And Tate, the beneficiary. But Charlie Hodgson, he just lured them to him like a siren. Wonderful stop. Powell couldn't help get there. Hodgson kicks it. That's a classic score from Sale. Reese had decided to join the pack when the ball was at his feet. It's there now, and Reese goes Number down, three. but the referee has decided to pull out a player to make example of. Number three is Martin Housel, and it is a yellow card, and that will taste very sweet to the Cardiff Blues players and supporters to see a yellow card as well as what will now surely be a victory in this match. Wigglesworth, Hodgson and Cueto who has been threatening over the last couple of minutes or so has to be a try, they get quick ball, they had the man on the right, they've still got them out wide one of them is Gaskell and he can go over for that try in the corner for Sal Hodgson has this lovely little delayed ball, he creates a hole first of all off the left hand of this ball and Gaskell very quick will score a lot of tries for a lot more Hodgson passes now, Tate tries on the outside, it's been dropped, and with that, have Sale's Heineken Cup chance has gone no, because the referee was playing advantage, and it's going to be a card, it's going to be 15 versus 14, and it's Martin Williams, the arch poacher, one of the best defenders in the Cardiff Blues team, holds them together. Wigglesworth, Hodgson, and it's stolen! It's all gone now for sale in this match. And maybe in the competition as a whole. Rush is underneath the post for the Cardiff Blues. They fall short just of the bonus point, but they do get the victory. Sale were too ill-disciplined, and for all of their three tries throughout this game, the Blues looked the better team.